Hey everyone, welcome to the show. So the Department of Justice appears to be running interference for Matt Gates. As you all know, Matt Gates is a Florida congressman and um, he was basically accused of sex trafficking and they seem to be trying to hide stuff for him. So there was an exclusive report that was published by the Daily Beast and they say that the House Ethics Committee is getting more and more impatient because the DOJ appears to be, quote, stonewalling them on information related to the Fed's investigation of Gates. As you guys know, um, he was looked at for a bunch of different crimes, but like I said, possibly sex trafficking of a minor, possibly having sex with that minor. Um, the DOJ refused to prosecute. They declined and they didn't give much explanation about it. I have always thought that his father, his former lawmaker daddy, who has a lot of money, who is very well connected, that he had a hand in this and that he's pulling the strings. Um, so I don't know. I have no proof of that. I'm just thinking it's not coincidental that that is his dad. So yeah, there, there are definitely two tiers of justice in this country. There's one for people like Gates, the little silver spoon brat boy down in Florida. And there's another one for the rest of us rubes. So anyway, according to the source who spoke with the Daily Beast or one of the sources, the House Ethics Committee is considering serving the DOJ with subpoenas to try to obtain this information because up until now they've been asking politely and it's not working. And the subpoenas have apparently been authorized already, but they just haven't been issued. It definitely seems though like something's up and they might have to take drastic measures or that extra step because another source told the Daily Beast it is very unusual for the Justice Department to play games like this, especially when their investigation is closed. You know, it's it would be normal if they said, no, we have an ongoing investigation. We can't share anything with you at this time. But it's been closed since the beginning of the year. Um, so the committee or actually I think it was last year that they closed it. So the committee apparently is still hopeful that they're going to get cooperation from the DOJ but you know we're getting now very close to election season florida's primary elections are only about three months away and you guys know what what happens right you know how they handle this stuff when we get close to an election they never want to be seen as trying to influence the election so everything just comes to a screeching halt so I will let you know when I hear more, but definitely seems like some shady stuff is going on at the DOJ. And I, I could have sworn that Merrick Garland said he wanted the people to have faith in the Justice Department once again after Trump was gone. We'll see if he actually means that. All right. Thank you all so much for watching and listening. Please like this video, share it, become a subscriber if you have not. If you can donate, truly appreciate it. Love you all. Take care. Talk with you soon.